Hey, how's it going everybody? It's Tanner here and welcome back to a new Ninjago Season 13 discussion video here on the channel. In today's video, we're going to be discussing more of that big Season 13 plot leak that we just got a while ago and we're going to go ahead and break down each individual ninja story. As mentioned previously, each ninja has a certain story here and we're going to go ahead and give each ninja their own video and kind of discuss exactly what their stories are. We're starting off with Cole because obviously he is the main focus of Season 13 so it would make sense to start off with his story and we're going to try to read it here the best we can. Again, there isn't a whole lot here that is actually correct English. A lot of it is very broken, possibly from a loose translation. So let's just go ahead and read through and see what we got. In the dungeons of Shintaro, Cole will have to face with the demons of her past and fulfill a promise given to Mother Lily before she died. It happened when Cole was very young. He could never reconcile with her death. When Cole spoke with her last time, he promised that she would be with him and be proud of him. Again, I'm kind of paraphrasing here, but you get the idea. In the bowels of Mount Shintaro, Cole finds a chance to keep that promise. <laughs> he learns about the legendary Squall Spinjitsu and uses it to defeat the enemy that his mother once fought with, but first he must become a full leader team. To apply the flurry of Spinjitsu, Cole first has to lead the motley of group of something from the bowels of Mount Shintaro, Shintaro. Okay, so obviously there's a lot of very, very, I guess, broken English going on here, and it's hard to just read everything, but from what it sounds like, Cole's going to try to fulfill a promise that he actually made to his mother before she died, and he has to go ahead and face an ancient enemy that his mother once fought. So that's probably going to be the Skull Sorcerer and all of, I guess, his minions. So it would make sense that Cole's mother used to fight people, as she was a previous elemental master of Earth, and it sounds like there's going to be some new type of spinjitsu that Cole has to learn, so maybe that's what the spinjitsu burst is going to be. And again, there's not a whole lot going on here, again, regarding, I guess, actual, uh, some type of comprehension. There's not a whole lot here that we can actually, you know, narrow down and be like, yes, this is the plot. But it does make a lot of sense. A lot of stuff going on here does seem like it could be accurate. And I hope that a lot of this is accurate because from what I can make out here from the broken English, it does sound very, very good. And again, Cole is going to be the main character. So it makes sense that his storyline would be focused on something regarding him and his mother, whom we have not heard of for a very, very long time. So it'd be nice to go ahead and actually have this plot be real. And from what Cole's story sounds like, it sounds like it could be very fun for his character. And it sounds like it's that sort of storyline that Cole's character desperately needed. A lot of people were very, very excited when they heard that Cole's season was finally going to be season 13, and I myself am very excited as well, and I can't wait to see what goes on with this season, and I can't wait to see what goes on with Cole's character. So thank you so much for watching this video, guys. If you enjoyed the video, be sure to like, comment, subscribe, do all that fun stuff, and check out the links down below in the description for my other forms of social media. As always, big shout-out goes out to my Patreon supporters, including once again, the Marvelous Jan. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Once again, my name is Tanner Fishies, and with that, I bid you farewell.